Hi there. Okay, so what I'm about to show you is how to install AdWords conversion tracking to your website through the Google Tag Manager. Google Tag Manager is one of my new favorite tools. It's a great way to manage tracking pixels on your website without having to hassle a um, your webmaster. So um, yeah, I highly recommend it. So I'm in the Google Tag Manager account, which is a Google product, so I just use my Google login. And I have here, which is one of my clients, and I'd set up a new container for it, and I go into the account. And you can see there are no tags here. So what I want to do is I want to click New Tag, and I'm going to call this AdWords oops, Conversion tracking. The beauty about this being a Google product is there are a lot of default tracking settings here so I just click this from the drop down list and it brings up these list of fields which I need to enter. So I just need the conversion ID and the conversion label. Now I need to tell it when to fire. When do I want this tag to load on my website. So I go to firing rules and I click add and choose from existing rules. So I don't want this to fire on all pages because I only want this to fire when somebody purchases something. So when an actual conversion takes place. So I have to click create a new rule and I'm going to call it a name. We're going to call it purchase. And then I have to tell it when to fire. So the URL to contain slash cart is the thank you page. And then I click save. And then I am done. So I click save. However, this is not live. I've just created it. Now I need to publish it. And you can see here this is unpublished. So first I have to create a version. So I create a version. And then I need to preview it. This is a good practice to debug it, to check that it's working. I won't be able to test that it's working because I won't be able to get to that page. But for analytics and stuff, you can do that. So I'll just exit preview mode. Okay, and then I want to click publish. Publish. And now my tracking code is live. And that's it. 